The World Bank has offered Indonesia $11 billion in loans over the next four years. $8 billion will come from the International Bank for Reconstruction and Development, while $3 billion comes from the International Finance Corporation and the Multilateral Investment Guarantee Agency. The offer was made by World Bank President Kim Yong Kim, Jim Yong Kim, on his visit to President Joko Widodo at the State Palace to pledge its commitment to help Indonesia's economy. During his visit, Kim will also visit Yogyakarta, a center for basic health services in central Java, and the Sunda Kalapa and Tanjung Priok harbors in Jakarta. After six decades of cooperation with Indonesia, especially in funding, Kim says the bank now wants to share its technical expertise in sectors like energy, health, education, maritime economy and services for rural areas. Finance Minister Bambang Rojinogoro, who was in the meeting, says the president told Kim he wants Indonesia's cooperation with the World Bank Group to focus on health, business climate and tourism. We discussed the ways to further strengthen our partnership as the, as the minister suggested and we found that uh, we fee that uh, we can support the vision and mission of president widodo and this administration in ways that are very inspiring and challenging uh, for us uh, we uh, i offered to the president as much as 12 billion dollars uh, over the next 3 to 4 years uh, to support large investments in uh, in both physical and